Hi and welcome to another installment of Math Basics, Mr. Besh. Uh, here's another one and done. Today we're going to calculate the volume of a prism, more specifically this trapezoidal prism. So when you're calculating the volume of the prism, the first thing you want to do is identify the base shape. Remember, every prism has two base shapes and they usually are other shapes other than rectangles unless you're talking about the cube or rectangular prism. In this case, this is a trapezoidal prism. So my bases are my trapezoid shapes. So then what I need to do is I need to go to my formula sheet and I need to identify the trapezoid. When I do this, the formula for finding the area of a trapezoid is 1 half times h times the quantity b plus b2, b1 b plus b2. So now what I need to do is take my picture and my model and then take my formula model and I need to figure out exactly which number goes with which of the terms, the variables. So b1 here is in the same place as 8 and h is in the same place as 7, and b2 is in the same place as 14. So then what I do is I take my values and I substitute in place. So now I get 1 half times 7 times the quantity 8 plus 14. And then when I do the math here, I'm going to get 77. 77 is the area of the trapezoidal face. That base shape right there, just that is 77. Now to find its volume, what you then need to do is once you find the area of one of the trapezoids, you then take your area, 77, and multiply it by the distance that your bases are apart, which is 20. Remember, the distance or height of a of three-dimensional shape is the distance between your two bases, which came out to be 20 in this example. And 77 times 20 is going to give us our answer, which is 1,540 cubic inches. Remember, all volume is labeled in whatever their unit is, cubed. That's that. I hope you found this both helpful and informative.